Hey guys, this is Early1981 and welcome back to the Golf Club 2019. Today I am delighted to be making a start on my PGA Tour career live on the channel and our first event that I'm going to showcase for you guys is the Legends Championship at Fiddler's Green. Now as you can see by these screenshots here, we have started a rivalry against Justin Rose. Um, I did begin this rivalry or the computer begin this rivalry for me in the earliest stages and we did win this rivalry convincingly and I did get the the medal unlock that you get for that I won rivalry complete as you can see against Justin Rose. It has now set me up with a rivalry against the one and only Jack Nicholas. So let's get back to this event, the Legends Championship at Fiddler's Green. This is an event I need to win for a trophy as well. The AI is on hard, which means the fairways are firm, greens are firm, and normally the wind speeds are quite high. I didn't fancy the very hard due to the very firm greens and things like that, because after a while it becomes so boring. I thought the firm would be a challenge enough in it itself. I'm not sure if the AI um, ups its performance through the, the various difficulty levels, or if it's just the course conditions at Harden. But the Legends Championship here at Fiddler's Green, one round, on hindsight, probably should make this two rounds because I do need to to win uh, to win for the trophy, and I do want to um, just let me play the shot. I do want to uh, complete the game and platinum it, and this is one of the the medals I've yet to to receive. So a nice opening drive there, despite the fast. I have won the majority of the events. Like I say, some of them I've just quickly played through. But you're having to shoot 9, 10, 11 unders on most event through one rounds to, to win this. So 132 yards into the win. Pitching wedge definitely the club in the firm greens. It's going to come up a little bit short. And I've gave myself a bit of work to do here. That's actually going to roll off the green. So not the start I was looking for. I have added the top 150 players currently in the world to the AI. That took a fair amount of time, so I had to change their names, change their nationality, and get their appearance as close as I could to what they actually look like. And that chip shot just comes up short. So hopefully we can convert this three-foot putt for the par, which we do. And we are going to start off the round at level par. So as you can see, Luke Less, Dustin Johnson, both at the top of the leaderboard there. Just going to aim this down the right-hand side of the fairway, let the wind take us back round, and hopefully set up a nice approach shot into this par 5. I'm convinced we can reach this in 2, you know. This should get past 300 yards easily. 314 yards, so hopefully we can attack this with... It's I was going to say the two would, but we're nowhere near that. This hybrid should be more than enough. Just lofting up, applying a touch of fade here to counteract the wind and see if we can get on the green for two and set up an eagle opportunity. This should run out fairly well for me. That is a fantastic approach shot there. Really, really happy with that. Looking about a six to seven foot putt for eagle here. Six foot putt. Down two inches, green speeds are 163. Hopefully we can get to two under par here. Didn't turn. Didn't turn at all. You could argue I played that too firm as well. So probably struggling for the birdie now. Going to have a similar putt. We're actually going to have a more challenging putt now. At least this one's uphill. Really disappointed with that putt. So we do pick up the birdie there. Hopefully that eagle putt is not going to come back and haunt me here because I really want to win this event. So Luke Less, Dustin Johnston, Tiger Woods, all at the top of the leaderboard there. Fantastic to see these these names there. So par three here, 10 mile, while, 10 mile per hour wins behind us. So dropping down to the eight iron here. Lovely strike. That's going to come up short. I was trying to kick it on from the front of the green, but it's just going to catch 
that mound there and work back off. So that is a failed green that we've managed to hit. So got to, got to get this close now. Certainly don't want to drop shots. That should turn. This should be a great shot. That should start to turn. Played that shot to perfection almost. One thing I have learned that if you do get bogeys, kiss goodbye to the top of the leaderboard. You will not win events. But I just want to try and play the big events for you guys on the PGA Tour. So we're still one under. Need to get things moving. Way behind the top of the leaderboard currently. We are swinging well. I should find the center of the fairway. Should run out well for me as well on the firm greens and fairways. But I do think the next time I do have to compete an event to win a trophy, I will set it to two rounds just to try and be safe. Nine iron should be the club here. Once again, fantastic strike. The wind should start to take it round. We're coming up short once again. Is it going to stay up? Just stays up. But wow. Miscalculation with yardage there. So we've got ourselves an 18 foot putt for the birdie. It is up four inches. Don't think we've played that firm enough. Never had the line neither. So it's just going to be another part. And I really need to start making things happen now. We're one under through four. Luke List is eight under. So I'm currently seven shots off the leader. Why, this is actually going to be a tough ask now. This should be a drive on a pitch, I would imagine. Maybe even a flop shot, you know. Really swinging well. With a downhill element in the wind, this should really be way past 340 yards, I would imagine. 343 yards, so it should be a flop shot. Let's have a look. 52. I think the flop shot gets there with the wind and the run out. Downhill element, I'll probably play a fast also. This should be good. I am happy with that outcome. Probably an 8 foot putt for birdie. 10 foot. Looks good. Oh, Lee, once again we're missing the birdie putts. I'm not getting myself close enough to give me guaranteed birdies though. And we are going to remain at 1 under par. Wow. Ah, Luke List 9 under. Tiger Woods now second on the leaderboard. We will have a glance at the leaderboard very shortly. Par 5 here, but we do have a, a double figure headwind against us here. Going to struggle to reach us in 2. But I do hope all you fantastic subscribers have had a great start to the year. And I do hope 2019 is the year for you. I am certainly looking forward to this year. Personally, and with the channel, I really want the channel to grow this year. My target is to reach 2,000 subscribers this year. I know that's a big ask. I've, oh, the wind's going to take me more left than allowed for. It. So it's going to be a chip shot. Hopefully we can convert this. But that is my target this year. To continue to play and enjoy the Golf Club 2019. And hopefully reach that 2,000 subscriber mark. We're just short of the 1,800 subscribers. That is a great shot if it sits. Really played that well. Now surely we can convert this birdie putt. And get to 2 under par. And start making a march up this top of the leaderboard. So 2 under. We are 7 shots behind. Oh, Luke List has dropped. Two shots there. Wow, he was 9 under, so he must have picked up a double bogey. We are now only 5 shots behind. Just going to apply touch of touch of fade here. Oh, 
Wind's starting to bring it round. This should be good. This should be really, really good. Get in. Get in. Oh, just miss out on the ace. And I'll tell you what, that is a fantastic tee shot there into the green. And that should guarantee us a birdie, which we do convert and we move to three under par. Hopefully only four shots behind Luke List now. We are, Tiger Woods is five under, Dustin Johnson is four under. So starting to make things happen now. Probably just going to come up short of the green here. Probably looking at a chip shot or a flop shot. But imagine that's not going to make it onto the green. It's probably going to run off the side here. Don't go in the bunker. Oh, wow. Really couldn't have visioned that happening, to be honest. So now, this is more difficult shot now. Flop shot from the pit oh, pitching wedge out. 78 to 86. Great execution. Is it going to run out enough? Oh, wow, I've really left that short. I'll be honest, I expected a fast, fast there. So a 15-foot putt. Uphill, it's going to turn to the right. This is a big putt. Turn, turn, turn. Yes, what a fantastic putt that is. And we do convert to birdie. And we are now creeping up that leaderboard. And we are now third. Three shots behind Luke List. Two shots behind Tiger Woods. Tony Finau is now on the leaderboard also. And hole nine. Applying a touch of draw here just to counteract the wind. I've put a fast on that, but it's going to be perfectly fine. And that is fine. The centre of the fairway, and that's going to run out well for me once again. Hundred and thirteen yards, up eleven feet into the wind, severe slope at the front of the green, don't want to be short here. Just de lofting the Sam wedge. This slight decline slope will add a few yards to my shot also. I've executed it well. Are we going to be rewarded here? Sit. Sit, sit, sit. Decent approach shot. Gotta be happy with that. Probably six to seven foot putt for Birdie. Seven foot. No gimme though. Downhill. And it is turning to the right. Just going left edge here. Turn. Boom. And we we are on a fantastic birdie run here. Really happy with this run in the last few holes. And that puts us to two shots off the lead. One shot off Tiger Woods. But great to have a rivalry with the one and only Jack Nicholas. Like I say, I have added a few legends as well. I think I added Colin Montgomery, uh, Seve Ballesteros, Sam Sneed, Jack Nicholas, Jesper Parnovic. I've added guys like that as well because after the top 150, I was thinking majority of you guys wouldn't have heard of any of these golfers. I've not heard of them myself, so hopefully we see as many familiar names on the leaderboard competing with myself as possible. 142 yards, into the wind, up 14 feet, aiming us right at the flag, wind and slope's going to bring us back, 9 iron should run out a bit here, and that is another fantastic approach shot, and hopefully we can convert this birdie and keep this birdie run going here, really playing well at the moment, we do convert the birdie, and we should now be one shot behind Luke List unless he's birdied out himself. We are one shot behind. He is finished. Luke List has currently finished his 18 holes. So it's all now down to me. If I can get two more birdies, we are looking good to win this event. It's another decent swing. Perfect, perfect. Just going to be short of the green once again. I would imagine that this is going to be a pitch shot. 53 yards into the 10 mile per hour wind. Slofting this up a few touches. Greens are firm, so it, should, it shouldn't sit down instantly. Hit the flag. Good approach shot though. 
probably about a five foot putt. Four footer. Once again, certainly no gimme though. And we do convert that birdie and we move to joint top of the leaderboard with Luke List at 7 under par. Wow. Tiger Woods is also finished. The only real threat could now could be Tony Finau. who's currently on the 14th. I just need one more birdie here to claim top spot. And I am swinging well, so hopefully we can achieve this. I've got no idea what happens if I finish at 7 under as well. I've not had a situation where I've actually tied with a leader. I wouldn't imagine the game's advanced enough to, to say it would go on a playoff. I would probably imagine you would just share share the win with it, the AI. This is going to be long. I didn't expect it to kick on as much as that. Didn't turn back as much as would have liked either, so 27 foot putt for Eagle. Certainly don't want to make a mess of this. Just want to lag this up there and make sure the birdie. Weight was really, really good. Oh, just miss out an Eagle there by one or two feet. But we do take the outright read, the outright? Yeah, the outright lead. And hopefully we can now see this out and pick up the Players' Championship victory here. I would really love to pick up the medal for this, the trophy on the PSN. And get one step closer to Platinum in this game. Hope I've got enough club here. Come on, get down. It's going to be long. Wow. Sit. Ah, That's going to trickle away down that slope. And this could be a tricky up and down from here. Just lofting this up a touch. Hit the flag. Hit the flag. Great shot there. It's going to be looking about a 3-4 to four foot putt for par. 3 footer. Nothing in that. And we do get the up and down to save par there. And we are going to remain at 8 under par. I really hope that you guys are looking forward to the rest of this PGA Tour career as much as I am. It is actually a mode on the game that I'm really enjoying. Like I say, I've had to play right through the web tour, all the qualifiers, I have forgot all the names, just to get to the PGA Tour. And we will play the big tournaments. And then what I'm planning to do is just host in my own private society against the AI. I think it's more or less an offline society and I will play the PGA Tour season on that. All the big tournaments and events for you guys along with the course reviews and the odd match play. Good strike again. Just looking to chase this up onto the green. It's going to come up short though. Why way short? Oh. Probably helped me out. That's probably actually helped me out because we're probably looking at a pitch shot now. Oh, flop shot. 42 yards up 12 feet. Execution is really, really good. Is it going to run out for me? Yes, it does. Really happy with it, the way I've played the flop shot today at times. And hopefully this is a birdie and move us to 9 under. Boom, we do have a two-shot lead here. And it's looking really good for us for winning the Players' Championship here. The Legends' Championship, I do apologise. I do apologise. The Players' Championship is at Sawgrass. That's, I think that's actually the next event on the schedule here. But it's the Legends' Championship we are playing here. But I'm convinced you need to win this to unlock a trophy to go towards your platinum of the game. So, so far, so good. After a slow start, we are sitting at 9 under, 188 yards uphill. 
off this slope, just de-lofting this a touch, the wind should counteract this slope here. Good strike, really good clean strike. And this should make its way towards the flag stick with the firm greens. Sat down a lot quicker, but as you can see, there is a severe slope there that really kills the momentum of the ball. And I've got a 30 three foot putt. Up two feet. This is tough. This is a tough putt. Par from here is really, really good. But I don't want to be dropping shots now. Not at this stage. I don't think I've hit that. Is that going to come back? Oh, wow. Could be dropping a shot here. 17 foot putt. Still six inches up to go. Really under hit that putt. So this is a really important putt now, and I don't think I've hit that far enough either. Oh, Lee, so we are dropping a shot there, unfortunately, guys. And we are going to be moving back to 8 under, and that just gives us a one-shot cushion now. I really hope I'm not going to have a Jean Von de Velde moment down this final few holes here. This would be disaster if we don't walk away now with this, this um, trophy for the PSN. Not disaster, but you know what I mean. So hole 16, looks like it's going to be quite a challenging hole. At least the wind's dropped down now, the wind's only single figures now. Looks like it's going to be a tough approach into the green from this area here. We are on an uphill slope. Into the wind. I'm going to have to deal off this 8 iron and really attack this pin. Ah, oh, put a slow on it. So we're certainly not worth walking away with birdie here. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Absolute disaster. And look at the, where the drop shot is to. Wow. Oh no. We could well be throwing this away here. I need to get this close just to walk away with bogey. Great execution. Come on, run out, run out, run out, run out. Ah, it's decent. It's going to give me a bogey putt, but I could be walking away with double bogey here. 13 foot or down 4 inches. I just need to attack this. It's all or nothing now. Turn. Turn. Oh, what a putt that is. That could well be the saving putt. And we are dropping back down to seven under par. And we're going to have a joint lead with Luke List. I've got two holes to make something happen here. This is the toughest hole in the course. It's stroke index one. I think seven iron gets here with a 10 mile per hour win behind me. That's a far better strike. This is going to be long, believe it or not. Sit down. Sit down. Hit the flag. Oh. And with the firm greens, it's really going to run out a lot more than I would have liked. This is going to be a tricky birdie opportunity now as well. 24 feet. I need to get a birdie. Better weight in that one there. I did play that far better weight. I tell you what. I've left myself a tricky par putt coming back here. No, there's nothing in this. Five footer. So we're going down to 18th. It's all tied. Wow. You couldn't have made this up. Two, three holes ago, I thought I had this in the bag. And I've got no idea what will happen if I finish at seven under with Luke List. So, down to 18th. What an exciting final hole this is. This is a nervy drive as well. Just going to apply a touch of draw on this. Beautiful contact. That draw's not coming into effect at all. I could be running out of fairway here. No, we are just going to cling on to the far right-hand side of the fairway, but that's going to make things more difficult now. Mind you, the wind's in our favour here. Seven irons got to be the club. That wind can break, bring us back round here. Just deal off in the 7-iron a few touches. 
It's a great strike. Oh, this should be nice. Come on, that should run out a good bit for me. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's going to be a bird. Oh, wow, sit down. Oh, wow. Didn't see that coming. This is going to be a long putt. So this one's for birdie. I've got to make sure I hit this one and just get a lag putt up here. Turn, turn. Oh, once again, I've left that about nine feet short. Wow. This is a big putt now. I can't believe how poor my putting has been on these uphill putts. It's not turning. Oh my goodness, where's the golfing gods? And we have blew it on the 18th. We are not winning. We're going to finish at six under par. What a disappointment that is in the end. But wow, what an entertaining first PGA Tour career on the channel here in the Golf Club 2019. And I hope you guys have enjoyed watching that. I've certainly enjoyed watching and playing that. So, Luke, let's finish at top of the leaderboard. Tiger Woods is there. Dustin Johnson, Justin Rose, Jimmy Walker, all a lot of top names there, guys. But that is it for the first round of my PGA Tour career. And um, as you can see, we won our battle against Jack Nicholas. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take care, peace out, and love you all. Bye.